everybody. Welcome to Creole Taffy's Kitchen. And today we're going to be making crawfish etouffee. And first off, I'm going to introduce to you the ingredients that we're going to use today. So here we have our crawfish tails. And for seasonings, we have some ground cloves, some black pepper, kosher salt, Creole seasoning. We have some unsalted butter, chicken broth, flour, garlic, onion, bell pepper, celery, green onion, fresh parsley. So these are our ingredients that we're gonna get started with and we'll be back. Hi, so we're back and I've gotten all the ingredients ready to go. And we have about a pound of clean crawfish, a couple of cups of uh, chicken broth, about a half a cup of bell pepper, about a fourth cup of celery, one cup of onion, half a stick of butter, gonna use a couple of teaspoons of garlic, got about a fourth cup of flour, fourth cup of green onions, and we have a couple of tablespoons of parsley, also for garnishment. And then we have our seasonings all ready to go, and we'll be back. Hi, so here we're melting butter. Got our butter in here, and we're gonna add in our flour. Just like we're kind of like getting a little roux on here. And we're just gonna cook this for about four minutes, and we'll be back. Hi, so okay, so here we've been cooking the butter and flour, getting it a caramel color. But after about four minutes, it's, it's getting a color. And then we're gonna add in our onions. And our bell pepper. And celery. So we're gonna get this all incorporated in for about three or four minutes. And get this nice and pretty and we'll be back. Hi, so here we've got our saute going, and I just want to get some garlic in here. I want it to stir fry the veggies first, and then get the garlic going in here. For about a minute stirring the garlic, and then we're going to add in some broth after about one minute. Hi, so we're back. We've added the garlic, garlic to our veggies, and here we're going to slowly stir in some Broth in here. Okay. We added in the broth. And we're going to bring this to a boil. And then we're going to cut it down. And then we're going to simmer this first for about 15 minutes. We're going to cover it, cut it on low, and let it simmer. And we'll be back. Okay, so here we get ready to take this for a boil for 15 minutes. And I have to add my seasonings in there. My Cajun Creole seasonings and my salt and pepper and a little ground cloves. And mix that in there before I put the top on and let it boil for 15 minutes. And we'll be back. Hi, so we're back and gotten our looks like a nice gravy for our etouffee and here we're going to add in our crawfish And what I like to do is serve this over some rice, some white rice, and make some a salad, or 
have some French bread, hot buttered French bread with this. And there you have it. Everything's mixed, ready to go over the rice. And this is Creole Taffy's Crawfish Etouffee. And we're going to plate it up and we'll be back. Hi guys, so here's our finished ingredient, which I've put rice in there because I like to have it with rice and trim it with a little parsley or scallions. It's totally up to you. All right, this is Creole Taffy's Crawfish Etouffee. Enjoy.